already here. So I already knew the loss was going to be big. Some children lost their parents. Some parents lost their children. Friends lost friends. Our city lost good neighbors. Powerful words late today from the mayor of Kansas City, Kansas, a community still reeling from Sunday's mass shooting. It all started after midnight at Tequila Casey Bar. Here's the very latest. The second suspect is still on the run. He's considered armed and dangerous, and police told us, just told us, that surveillance from inside the bar showed that at least initially, the shooters fired at specific people. Then they started firing into the crowd as they retreated. These are the men now charged. Take a good look on right here. Now at the face on the left there in particular, Villanueva Morales is still on the run. As the search for him is continuing, KCTV5 stands for you with complete coverage. We begin with Kelly Taylor. Kelly. So Ellen, we just left KCK City Hall and we talked to Mayor David Alvey and Police Chief Michael York. They gave us an update on what happened right here at Tequila KC Bar. Here's some video for you, police. They are still on the search for Hugo Villanueva Morales this evening. He's considered armed and dangerous. Javier Alatore was arrested in Kansas City, Missouri overnight. Both men are charged with four counts of first degree murder. Bond was set at $1 million for each of them. Now police use surveillance video from inside the club to ID the gunman. And we talked to the bar owner about what was on that video. He says it shows an altercation earlier in the night. The suspect was put out of the bar after that. He told people inside he was coming back to shoot at everyone. The owner says that's when he called police. Nine people were shot. Four men were killed. The police say this was not a random shooting. From what I know is that we were dispatched to that call on a disturbance. We tried to locate the suspect. He had left prior to our arrival. And I don't believe we have any information indicating that he was going to come back and do what he did. I called the police. And then I called 20 minutes later. I called back again and I asked him, why is it taking so long? I said, this guy can shoot anybody. He can't be having a gun. He can be shooting anybody. And he told me they were having some other problems somewhere else. When I waited like 20 minutes, it took him at least another 10 more minutes. And that was, uh, something was going to happen in 20, 30 minutes. Something was going to happen, you know. But if they would have got there on time, and they would have prevented all this. And we talked to the bar owner. That's exactly who you just heard from. He asked not to go on camera and not to reveal his name. But coming up at 6 o'clock, we have more with the owner of Tequila KC Bar. And he talks about the future of his business live in KCK. Kelly Taylor, KCTV 5 News.